What if, all of a sudden, meat disappeared from your plate? How would your body react? Would you feel healthier, more energetic? Or would you start suffering from a lack of essential nutrients? Over the next 30 days, your body will undergo profound transformations. Your metabolism, digestion, skin, energy levels, and even your mood may change more than you imagine. But is that a good thing or a bad thing? In today's video, we will explore week by week the incredible changes and challenges of cutting meat out of your diet for a month. From the first signs of adaptation to the most surprising transformations in your body. And in the end, you decide, is it worth it or not? Week 1. Adaptation and Initial Impacts In the first few days without meat, your body enters adaptation mode. If you used to eat meat regularly, it now needs to find new sources of protein, iron, and other essential nutrients. But don't be fooled. This impact doesn't happen overnight. One of the first signs of change? Your hunger might increase. This happens because meat takes longer to digest and provides energy over a longer period. Plant-based foods pass through the digestive system more quickly, which can make you feel hungry sooner. Benefits of the first week Less inflammation. If you used to eat processed meats, you may notice reduced bloating, your face may appear slimmer, and fluid retention may decrease. More efficient digestion, the fiber in vegetables and legumes starts working, improving your intestinal transit. For many people, this means more regular trips to the bathroom. Change in taste perception. Surprisingly, some foods may start to taste better. With less saturated fat and artificial seasonings in your diet, your taste buds can become more sensitive to the natural flavors of vegetables. Challenges of the first week. Possible iron deficiency. If you don't replace it with iron-rich vegetables like spinach, lentils, and tofu, you might start feeling slightly fatigued. More frequent hunger. Since meat provides greater satiety, switching to a plant-based diet might make you feel the need to eat more often. Cravings for meat. For those used to the taste and texture of meat, the first few days can be difficult. The body and brain are still programmed to crave animal protein, especially if it has always been part of the diet. Narrator. In the first few days, you might feel like going back to your old routine. But what if you resist? What happens after the first week? Week 2. Impact on the brain and energy levels. After a week without meat, something starts to change, but you feel it in your mind first. Do you feel lighter or more tired? Many people report an increase in energy after eliminating meat from their diet. This happens because your body is digesting food more efficiently and spending less energy on digestion. Possible benefits? More energy. With lighter digestion, you may feel less sluggish. Improved circulation. Without the high cholesterol from red meat, blood flows better through the body. But be careful. Not everything is positive. The brain also feels the change. Challenges of the second week. Vitamin B12 deficiency. Meat is one of the main sources of B12, essential for brain function. Without supplementation, mental fatigue and memory lapses may occur. Less creatine in muscles. Creatine, naturally found in meat, helps with strength and endurance. Some people may experience a slight decrease in workout performance. If you are not consuming eggs, dairy, or supplements, you may start feeling the effects of B12 deficiency. Fatigue, memory lapses, lack of focus, these are classic signs that something is missing. If you train regularly, you might experience a slight drop in performance. But is this temporary or a long-term effect? Week 3. Effect on Gut Health and Skin If you've made it this far, congratulations! Your body has already gone through major changes. But now, your skin and gut will begin to show even more evident signs of this transformation. 
Benefits of the Third Week Healthier Gut Microbiota With increased fiber intake and the elimination of processed meats, beneficial bacteria in your gut thrive. This can improve digestion and even strengthen immunity. Clearer skin, without toxins and inflammation caused by processed meats, many people notice an improvement in their skin's appearance, less acne, and reduced oiliness. Believe it or not, your diet has a direct impact on your skin health. Excess red meat and saturated fats can cause inflammation, leading to pimples and irritation. Without these agents, your skin may appear clearer and healthier. Challenges of the Third Week Less satiety. If your diet is not well balanced, you may experience hunger and food cravings more frequently. Lower collagen production. Meat contains essential nutrients for collagen production, which keeps the skin firm and healthy. Without proper replacement through citrus fruits and vitamin C-rich vegetables, your skin may start to lose elasticity. Reducing meat intake can impact collagen production in your body. If you're not compensating with vitamin C-rich foods like citrus fruits and leafy greens, you might notice a slight loss of skin elasticity. Your gut has also felt the impact of this change. But are all these transformations positive? After three weeks without meat, you may be feeling better, lighter, but in the long run, what happens if you continue avoiding meat? Week 4. Fully Adapted Body Congratulations, you've completed the challenge. But now, the most important question. How is your body after 30 days without meat? Consolidated benefits? Lower cardiovascular risk. Studies show that plant-based diets can significantly reduce the risk of heart disease by improving cholesterol levels and circulation. Fewer toxins in the body. Processed meats contain preservatives and chemicals that can cause inflammation. Without them, your body is now cleaner. Increased energy and lightness. Many people report feeling more energetic and with a more balanced energy level throughout the day. Your metabolism has adjusted, your gut is functioning better, your circulation has improved. Sounds amazing, doesn't it? Possible challenges that may persist. Low intake of complete proteins. If the diet is not balanced with varied plant-based proteins, muscle loss and decreased physical performance may occur. Difficulty maintaining the diet. Some people report craving meat after a while, especially if they haven't planned good nutritional replacements. Now that your body is fully adapted, the big question remains. Will you continue without meat or return to your previous habit? What did we learn from this experiment? Cutting meat out for 30 days can bring surprising health benefits from gut and skin improvements to a healthier heart. But there are also challenges. Without proper planning, you may face important nutritional deficiencies. In the end, there is no right or wrong. Every body reacts differently. The most important thing is to understand your own body, know your limits, and find a balance that works for you. And you? Have you ever tried going a month without meat? How was your experience? Leave a comment below. If you enjoyed this video, like, subscribe to the channel, and turn on notifications for more content about health, nutrition, and well-being. See you in the next video. Ndiyao tsawa, sah?